For those who don't know about the new CBA, kind of put in a nutshell what that provides for the players. Yeah, in a nutshell, we have a lot of tools now. We tripled the top pay um, so that a couple of players will make over half a million dollars. Now, rookies will still make a more modest salary, but we have the ability to do team marketing agreements, league marketing agreements, off-season employment. So we have a lot of different tools now to drive player pay and the player experience, so better travel uh, and just better overall health and wellness benefits as well. And what do you hope the new CBA does for your current players and the players like Sabrina or Destiny Slocum out there, um, the future stars of the WNBA long term? Right, long term is to give us all these tools to pay the players more, give them a better professional athlete experience for moms, for fa their families. So really just, you know, a holistic, multi-dimensional approach to the experience of a professional women's athlete because the WNBA has been around over two decades, the only women's professional league to, to survive that long. So this is going to lift, I think, not just the WNBA, but all women's sports and also women in society, and that's my goal.